Food journaling is one of the most uh, useful tools when you're trying to understand uh, your own eating patterns and trends in your eating. Um, it brings great awareness to your choices. Um, it helps highlight trends in your eating you might not recognize. It's a great way to track how often you're eating, maybe what types of foods you're eating, where you're eating those foods, or who you're eating those foods with in a way that you may not have noticed before. So it could be something like realizing that you're eating out a lot more, buying your lunch as opposed to bringing your lunch from home. And maybe it's certain coworkers that tend to influence you to go to restaurants that you'd really like to go to not as often as you actually are. The single most important tool for actually discovering that relationship about yourself is by keeping a food journal. A food journal not just where you write down the foods, but write down how you felt that day. And if you felt bad, what was it that happened that made you feel bad on that day? And what I've seen is that when patients start recording these things, they become aware of how their emotions are very often influencing you know, their relationship to food. And that's the start of the change.